Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome. If you're new, welcome. Please make sure you click on the subscribe button so they can be part of this beautiful online family of mine. Today's video, I am sharing the Literacy PK Learning Binder. Yay, I'm so excited about um, this video. I'm excited about to show you guys what's inside the binder and how simple it can be for a child. The number of activities that a child will enjoy in this binder, things like finding the um, alphabets and finding the objects that uh, begin with the same letter sound and then they'll also be matching the later on like when it gets too complicated they'll be matching uh, the, the, the word with the correct word and they'll put very confusing words or clues like, like a lamp and jump and then the child must look very careful for the J and even the L and then they match those words this is the binder. Um, I bought this binder from Teachers Paid Teachers. I'll leave a link up here for the video where I was reviewing the math um, pre k learning binder, which is from the same um, author JDA that is. Uh, JDA has a store on Teachers Paid Teachers that's where you can purchase your learning binder. So basically the literacy uh, pre k learning binder, it's a literacy binder for kids. I'll say with the South African um, standard, it's kids below grade R, so from grade RR downwards basically because kindergarten I think it's like grade R in South Africa because it's the the last step at, <laughs> at preschool before they go to the big school to do grade 1 in America and these other countries. So here we have grade R, so the pre-K, so it's like grade RR downwards. So you can use this for a child that is uh, below grade R. But even if your child is in grade R, they can still learn a lot from this, even in grade 1 and even grade 2 even. Because some of these concepts, um, some kids might uh, have not learned them yet. So, so it would be a child's advantage to purchase it and to give the child to try it. But before you go and purchase it, I'm making it much easier for you because I'm going to give you a review. I'm going to go through this learning binder. Um, I will go through everything that's inside. What's nice about this binder is, since it's for kids, uh, for preschool basically I would say, they don't have to know how to write, they can just use lines and circles and then they can also use the manipulatives that you can do uh, for them or you can, they also cut out from the binder that you can cut out, laminate for them to match the alphabet. So basically it teaches the child things like letter sounds, A to Z. They're using small letters, which is good because these are the letters that your child will see when they are reading. What's nice about this binder, it's very colorful and it also has pictures in here which makes it interesting for a child to try on. Plus, these activities you can give a child say one sheet a day to do or two sheets a day depending on the time that you have or on the child's concentration span because sometimes they won't be interested. So, Talking about concentration span, I'm making a new video where I share some of the things that you can do to help increase your child's concentration span. And please subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you will not miss that video. This is how the binder looks from the outside, and here you can put your child's name. Um, I didn't put any name because initially the twins were using it together, so whose name I'm gonna put? The whose name really? And besides, you can pass it from one child to the next. So that's uh, your chart with all the letter sounds from A up to Z. And what's nice is they're using uh, small caps. And then this is like the simple exercise that they, they the easy one that they start with. So they draw a line from the letter to the picture beginning sound. So like this one's a ball, so it starts with a ball. So then they match that. And then it keeps on getting harder. Beginning sound, and then they also need to. Beginning sound, and then they also have. Oh, it's so dirty. I need to clean it. Then they also have a section like this where the child needs to recognize the letter and then they cycle the correct letter and they put very confusing alphabets like T and F. They look similar, so the child must look very careful to cycle the correct um, letter. Well, I'll show you my four year old uh, triangle spider and then I hope you guys will enjoy this. A, B, C, D, E, F. G H I J K L M N O P L L M N N N O O P P Q R R S T X S S T 
Very good. Right. So now I want to, to draw a line from a letter to the picture beginning with the sound. So look at the pictures and then you see what sound. What is this? Ball. What sound does it start? Ball. Exactly. So now you must match. Okay. <laughs> Good. You must say the the letter sound. Okay. No, don't try. Continue. What what letter sound is that? What is that in the picture? Cats. Good. What letter sound is that? What is that in the picture? Dog. Dog. Very good. So can you tell me the names of the pictures again? What is that? Ball. And that one? Apple. That one? Dog. That one? Cat. Very good. Yes. Do you know the pictures in there? Yes. What's the first one? Frog. The second one? Elephant. Third one? Hand. The fourth one? Eater. 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 Good, okay. So now you must draw a line from the letter to match the picture. Yes. The picture that begins with that sound. Yes. Okay. I thought that they leave. I want to color it. No, baby, we're not coloring. Why? Match it. Draw a line. You mean I think to color me? Look at me. I think I'm too pretty. Ah! Hello! Hmm? Exactly. <laughs> what's what's letter sound is that? Frog. It's letter sound. Huh? Letter sound is. And then the picture. Frog. Okay, continue on it. What letter sound is that? Good. Okay. And the picture. Guitar. 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 And then what's letter sound is that? And then the picture. Thank you so much, my baby. Good job. If you've watched until this point, thank you so much. And I hope you've enjoyed the video. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Like the video. Share it with your friends. And uh, please subscribe if you haven't done so already. Please follow me on Instagram and on Facebook. I'll leave the links on my description box. I'll also leave the links to other videos, to other educational videos. I'll see you on the next video. Thank you so much for watching.